things we don't know. Putting science in your hands. We spend a third of our lives doing it, yet it still isn't clear why we need to sleep. In fact, there's so many things we don't know about sleep that we don't have time to talk about them all today. What we do know is that we can't function without it. After missing just one night's sleep, you are likely to find yourself feeling hungry, emotional and unable to concentrate. Decisions will become difficult to make, your reactions will slow, you may become forgetful and your vision can be affected. Going without enough sleep can weaken the immune system, making you susceptible to colds and other infections and can even increase your blood pressure. So it is clear that sleep is vital, but why? Some believe that sleep is a way to conserve energy and stay out of harm's way. Animals that stay still and quiet during a part of the day are less likely to have accidents or be eaten by predators. Sleeping also uses up fewer calories than being awake, meaning that animals need to find less food each day than if they didn't sleep. But this only really explains why we rest during the night. Surely it would be safer to stay still and quiet but conscious, so if a predator stumbles upon your hiding place, you have a better chance of escaping. Also, this theory may explain why sleep is a good idea, but it doesn't explain all of the problems that are caused by missing out on getting enough sleep. Other researchers think that sleep is a chance for the body to repair itself. This seems quite believable. We all feel better after a good night's sleep. However, this theory seems to suggest that people who are more physically active, so need more bodily repair, should sleep more than those who are inactive. But although there is some evidence athletes sleep more after a race than normal, those who are completely inactive don't sleep any less. Most of the impairments seen in sleep deprivation, however, are cognitive, which suggests that sleep must be important for the brain. There is some evidence that the cells in the brain responsible for repair and restoration are more active during the night, suggesting it might be the brain that needs time to recuperate, rather than the body. In mice, a recent study by scientists at the University of Rochester found that cerebral spinal fluid flows around the brain ten times faster when they are asleep. This flushes out toxins more efficiently. The researchers argue that this could explain the need for sleep and the problems that occur when we don't get enough of it. But other researchers are sceptical, as this is yet to be shown to happen in humans. Another theory is that sleep is needed for memories to be stored properly. Researchers aren't clear exactly how this happens or why sleep is needed, but studies have shown that people are better at remembering things they have learned after a period of sleep. But although this might explain the cognitive difficulties people face when sleep deprived, it can't explain the physical symptoms. It may be that none of these theories are correct, or that more than one of them is needed to explain why sleep is so important. What we do know, though, is that people who get enough sleep that's around eight hours a night for adults are healthier, happier and more successful. So what better reason to get some shut-eye?